Hello YouTube, I am back with another quick update for OBS and Photoshop. After the uh, CC 2015 update and updating OBS finally because I slacked off on it, um, I noticed that there was a terrible problem and I think you can see it, it's that the cursor isn't scaled properly to what it should be for the brush size. And uh, after a certain size it gets completely offset and it looks terrible. So I looked around and tried to figure out how to fix it and couldn't find any documentation so I messed around for about a half an hour and I eventually came to a workaround. It's not super difficult, it's inconvenient but it works. So I will switch over to the fix and um, show you how to set it up. Alright, so here we are in the uh, other recording method as you can see my brush size scales properly and doesn't get offset and I can even change brushes here and works perfectly fine okay so now in order to do this if you've watched my previous video you know that I said that you had to disable arrow and that it had to be a monitor recording well for some reason that is now screwed up so what you have to do instead is pretty simple um, under game capture modes there is a mode called DWM monitor capture which basically plugs into your monitor as if it was recording a game so in order to get that to show up you have to go under settings and video and then make sure the arrow is not disabled so it's currently running and um, <clears throat> so after you do that you can start up game capture and go up into you know DWM monitor capture now what this does it captures your main monitor so if you're using like an Intuos Pro or anything like that, it'll work perfectly fine right out of the box as long as you do that and start recording. Um, now, if you're like me and you have, you know, Wacom Cintiq or Huion or Monoprice, you know, Bosto, anything that has a secondary screen that you want to record on, it won't work because it has to be your primary screen. Now, in order to do that, there's a really simple way. You just go to your background, right click and select screen resolution and then this pops up and you can see your my two displays here and we're going to pick the one that we want to be our primary one and click make this my main display and hit apply and OK and so it will now be your main display and all of your taskbar and all of your icons will move over there so um, <clears throat> you would have you know your taskbar down here and you can unlock your taskbar which is really simply just right click properties unlock or you might not even have to go that far. Anyway, <clears throat> and so you can drag it off and drag all your icons over and it'll save the position of your icons and everything as long as you're not going across different resolutions. So after you get that done and you start it up and you try to record, it will still record your other monitor because you have to do, you have to restart your computer and for, and for OBS to pick up that it has changed. So after you do that, it restarts and you log back in, you're good to go that's all you have to do now if you want to go the other way just uh, you know change your you know drop it down go to screen resolution switch what your primary display is if you want to go back to your main display for gaming or whatnot hit OK and then every other program besides OBS should instantly transition over um, but you know like I said if you're using OBS to record something you have to restart in between to get it to record the proper screens so that's the uh, quick fix I came up with, or I guess it's technically a workaround. Um, it's been driving me insane for quite a while, and I finally had time to get around to trying to fix it. So now that that's out of the way, hopefully I'll get around to uh, recording some more videos. Uh, I'm going to make a quick video to show how to record uh, time lapses without zooming in and panning around so it's a bit easier on the viewer, as well as some speed paintings and, you know, tutorials and thoughts from places. So. Here's to uh, getting recording and life back on track, and I hope this works out for you guys, and uh, if it doesn't, leave me a comment. Mm -hmm. Cheers.